Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video today. Today it is my Premier League predictions for week 22. Um, but before I get into that, I should, uh, one shock in the FA Cup, then a few more. But I'm only going to recover one and that's Leicester losing to Newport. Um, a fourth round draw is tonight as I'm recording this. So, you know, I don't know who I'm going to get in the fourth round. But I think that's a complete shock. Um, I think Leicester played the game wrong. Um, you know, it's all one thing. And they got Southampton in this week, Premier League. Um, and obviously get my prediction when we get down to it. But guys, you know what to do. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. And let's go. So the first game we're going to talk about is West Ham Arsenal. Um, you know, West Ham drawing to Brighton, coming back from two goals down. Um, obviously, you can see the vlog on my channel anyway. Um, now looking back at it, I think Brighton were lucky to get the point, even though we went 2-0 up. Um, I think West Ham slightly deserved the three points over Brighton, but... You know, it's a point of peace, and I'll take that any day of the week, um, especially because I come from Brighton, and as I said, you can see the vlog up on my channel. Um, but with this game, Arsenal and not Emery, um, they start getting straight to strip slowly, so I'm going to predict a draw for this one, and I'm going to go with a one on scoreline. I think Pellegrini might just be able to work that Arsenal side a little bit more easier than what people expect. The next one is the obviously where I just said I'm from um, and who I support is Brighton versus Liverpool. Um, you know, Liverpool losing to City, City closing that gap on Liverpool. Um, now, how much I would like to say that I think Brighton are going to win this, I can't see it. Um, you know, it's one of them things I think where. You're going to have to go against your own team and um, just hope for the best that they might come out on top. But I don't think Brighton are. So I'm going to predict to Liverpool win for this one. And I'm going to predict a 3 0 scoreline to Liverpool. Well done to Brighton ladies um, against Liverpool ladies. They did win their game 2 0. Um, the next one is Burnley versus Fulham. Two low clubs. Um, Fulham got knocked out of the cup I think it's by Oldham um, and I think Burnley went out as well um, put it down in the comments below I might be wrong um, but yet again I'm going to predict a draw and I'm going to predict a nil-nil scoreline I don't think Fulham got the power in uh, Mitzvich I don't think Burnley got the power in any of their strikers um, I knew they scored a penalty actually I think Burnley won one nil and, uh, you know, he's got to have our penalty. So that's why I predicted a 0 0 scoreline. The next one is yet again two low teams. Um, one's out the relegation zone, um, and one's in it, uh, right bottom. You can tell who it is behind me anyway. So it's Cardiff versus Huddersfield. Um, you know, Huddersfield is a a large bell with you for David Wagner. Um, Cardiff are out the cup as well. You know, it's always been happening in the cups with the Premier League teams. Where Premier League teams think they're going to walk it. I'm one of these neutral football fans, which is how I say how I do this. Where I, I don't believe any money shows in the cup. Anyone could beat anyone on their day. But as far as the fish goes, I've got to predict a Cardiff win for this one. And I'm going to predict a 3-0 scoreline. The next one is another London derby. It's Crystal Palace versus Watford. Um, you know, Palace ain't doing too badly. Um, nor will Watford. Uh, Watford go for a dippy spell and then they sort themselves out. So... With this one, I'm going to predict a draw, and I'm going to predict a one all scoreline. The next one is a team that got knocked out against Newport, against uh, Southampton. It's obviously Leicester versus Southampton. Um, 
Now, Southampton still flying low. Um, their new manager hasn't worked out as expected. But yet again, on the other side is the Lions bow start reading for Leicester manager. Um, Leicester are going to win this one. Uh, I'm going to predict a 3 1 scoreline for Leicester. The next one is Chelsea versus Newcastle. Uh, high flying Chelsea against low flying Newcastle. Uh, apparently, Newcastle ain't got no money in the transfer window. Um, you know, so I'm going to predict Chelsea to win this game and I'm going to predict a 4 0 scoreline. The next one is Everton versus Bournemouth. Um, you know, Bournemouth got knocked out by Brighton in the cup. Um, you know, and Everton did win their game, can't remember who against. Um, but I think Everton had another close score. I think they only won it 2 1. Um, so, yeah, again, it could have been a few a few other Premier League Cups being knocked out of the cup this weekend just gone. Um, but as far as the result goes, I'm going to predict an Everton win. And I'm going to predict a 2-1 scoreline for that one. The next one, and it's probably game of the weekend, is Spurs versus Manchester United. Um, you know, Anagar Solskjaer doing ever so well. Um, as caretaker manager of Man United, I'd be very disappointed as a neutral football fan if he weren't in charge at Man United come the end of the season and got the full-time job. Um, Spurs, on the other hand, they aren't doing too badly either. Um, it's a real dogfight between them and Arsenal. But for this one, I'm going to call it a draw and I'm going to go with a one-all scoreline. The last one of the weekend, um, my last prediction is Manchester City versus Wolves. Um, you know, Man City, as I've said earlier in this video, close the gap on Liverpool. I don't want to do it again, and I'm going to predict to do it again. But I'm not going to expect an easy game um, for City. But I'm going to go with a 2 1 scoreline for City. So, guys, anyway. Give this video a big crap thumbs up if you enjoy it. Guys, you know what to do. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Ciao for now.